What sort of business are the French up to there? Just occupying the territory? It is an economic incursion more than a geographical one. Some of the ruffians are sponsored by enemies of the colonies. They intend to undermine local authorities. I've heard they steal from civilians and resell essential goods for ten times the price. It's always the little fella who gets skinned. Colonel, you and Gist here seem inspired. Is there something in the water, or in the whiskey? Now why do you say that, Master Cormac? I think Shay here is skeptical about our intentions towards our fellow man. I understand, but there is no need. I simply want these colonies to be a place of safety, development, and purpose. We're heading hard for land, sir! I thought oh, rich men wanted them to be a place of profit. Take her away! Jusqu'à nouvel ordre. Félicien, j'ai une mission spéciale pour vous. Suivez-moi. Charles, tu remplaces Terrien jusqu'à ce qu'il se remette de sa blessure. Une minute. Il essaie peut-être de nous berner. Je te fais ce Allez Donc je me suis enrôlé pour une autre année. Tranquille, pas. Oh 
Good show, Shay. Now let's use those materials to give the Morrigan more firepower. It's the captain's Your ship! Your ship is in fine form, Master Cormac. That port should offer little resistance. I rather hope the frogs offer some, else this will be a dull day. Never wish for battle, Master Gist. There is plenty around here for any of our lifetimes. Besides, if we find the fort's commander, the French will surrender, no? Indeed, that is a sensible strategy. But we will have to wear down There's the fort's target, defenses Shay. first. Knock her down like a game Otherwise, of nine, they can dig in. Begin there. by hitting her towers. As the colonel says! Fire! She's weakest right there, sir! Fire! Ah! 
Chasseur? Say, it has been so long. Were you on a special mission? Yes, from Achilles. How interesting. So am I. Don't make me do this, Le Chasseur. Do what? Assassinate me? I thought that was your specialty. We could both just laugh. Ah, but then I would tell you. Don't make me do this, Le Chasseur. Do what? Assassinate me? I thought that was your specialty. We could both just leave. Ah, but then I would tell your brother that you are a... You are always good at your business, Shay. As were you. Tell me, what are you doing in land? Special weapons. Poisonous gases to use against colonial authorities. I am merely a delivery man. And may your final delivery be swift.
Le Chasseur was right. I... I had no other choice. If the assassins find out I'm alive, they'll come after me. While you were busy taking down that fort, I happened to stumble upon the treasury. You don't say. It was the damnedest thing. <clears throat> uh, well, in, in any case, a mo Loose and trim too. Douse all but mates. There's more passion. I'm waiting for you. You want to help us? Oh, 
Ah, Master Cormac. What you have learned from Le Chasseur was confirmed. The local lawbreakers are changing tactics. What's their plan now? Their boss has hired Benjamin Franklin to produce new weapons for them. He's very well guarded. Benjamin Franklin? The scientist? You have heard of him. Good. He is making equipment to spread gases among the populace. Toxic ones, as it turns out. The populace? I thought they would use it against the authorities. Though that would be terrible as well. The ruffians we have arrested refer to an intimidating woman. I believe she is behind these nefarious plans. I look into this. Thank you. Hope. I pray it's not you. But it sounds explosive. The boss really wants fright. Uh -huh. No one interrupts his work. Really? Good to see you again. Your friend Hope said you were away. I, I, I was. Uh, sir, I, I've come to collect the results of your experiments. Oh, well, it's a very good thing, then. I just finished fixing the prototype. Here you go. I was preparing to leave for Philadelphia, and then Europe. I was invited to lecture in London. Oh, would you be so kind as to inform Mistress Hope? Yeah, of course. God, Hope. What are you doing with these felons? Turning the city against itself. What have you become? Something the matter, Master Cormac? Uh, no, no. Yes, just old memories. When I am issued new recruits burdened with regrets, I tell them the surest way to lose them is with gunpowder. You're right, Colonel. This prototype seems very powerful. Use it with care, Master Cormac. Our intelligence says this thing can destroy certain fortifications, as well as injure several enemies at once. There is also a more subtle way to use it. Some of these grenades contain a strong sedative. Fire one into the crowd and they will fall asleep immediately. We should test this new weapon. 
Use it against that door. Use these grenades to destroy that door. Go ahead, Master Cormac. Shoot the door. Use these grenades to destroy that door. Good work. Good work. I think you are ready to turn this new weapon against the ruffians who have used it. There is an abandoned factory nearby hiding a dangerous poison. Right now, we only call it. And that's my first target. So long. I got you. I mess with this, maybe I can break the whole system. Get out, or I'm as good as dead. Someone call the guard.
Ah. What marvelous destruction, Captain. I saw the smoke all the way from the Morrigan. That should discourage those miscreants. New York is safe for now. With all due respect, Colonel, it's going to take more than a few explosions to get rid of this kind of trouble. The boy is right, Colonel Monroe. Shay, was it? Congratulations. You just burned a whole lot of rats out of New York. I'm Jack Weeks. This is William Johnson. I don't know about him, but I'm pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you as well. It is, uh, terribly dusty here. I'm sure Shay can recount his adventures to us over a pint. Hey, the first round's on, uh, the Colonel, huh? <laughs> Something the matter, Master Cormac? Just a little confused. I uh, must have breathed some of that gas. Some ale will do you good. Come, we are all friends here. You will be taken care of. Colonel. Dear Master Cormac, my apologies for the brevity of this missive, but it is time we were honest with one another. You have demonstrated your loyalty and resourcefulness to the Templar cause, and this despite and perhaps because of your assassin origins. The man you saw, yours, Colonel George Monroe. On your post, guest. The colonel's in trouble. How do you mean, in trouble? He's at Fort.